What's up, movie crew? So today is Tuesday. You know what that means. It's new release Tuesday. Yeah, I have not done one of these in a while for a couple of different reasons. Anyway, before I get anything, if you are new to this channel, my name is Luke. This is Let's Watch a Movie. And if you're in anything cinema and physical media related, you've come to the right place. So hit that subscribe button. All right. So the last few months, I've been doing a lot more online purchases because the stores in my area have cut back on their Blu-ray section. However, we are a couple of weeks before Christmas, and I want to make sure I get my stuff before Christmas. The two biggest things that I am looking to pick up today are the Silent Night Deadly Night Collection and Smile. I know there's a couple other things out, but those are the main two things I'm going to get now. And maybe I'll come back over here in a couple days if there's other stuff. But I am in front of Best Buy right now. I'm going to go in there and see what they got. All right, first stop of the day, well, only stop of the day, is Best Buy. Let's see if they've got that latest one, Smile. And hopefully they have that Silent Night, Deadly Night collection because they have been on a roll lately with those Vestron titles. All right, so they've got spots for The Woman King and Highlander, but they don't have any right here. We got Clerks 3. We got Westworld. All right, so I gotta rant here for a second. This show is amazing. They canceled it with season, the planned season five was gonna be the final one the cast is still getting paid for the show that they're not making. Warner Brothers not only canceled it, but now they've announced they're pulling it from HBO Max. WTF. Reservoir Dogs. Nope. We got some Christmas 4Ks here. Spider-Man. Mortal Kombat. That will be in tomorrow's video for anyone that wants to check out my What I Watched for November. We got those Star Trek 4Ks. Poltergeist. Secrets of Dumbledore. We got Super Pets. Jurassic World Dominion. Dog. 310 to Yuma. Heat and My Hero Academia. And over here, the... Let's see, we got a... Uh, uh, well, there's where Smile would be at. All right, we got Pulp Fiction, the 4K and the Steel Book. Top Gun Maverick, Amsterdam on 4K kudos on that one because I remember reading at one point there was talks of that not getting one. Godfather on 4K. Planes, trains, and automobiles. Lightyear Steelbook. Alright. I have not picked up the Batman Steelbook yet. Because I've already got a Batman Steelbook. I got all of the exclusives back when they came out in May. Should I add this one? It won't be today, but should I add it? Comment down below. Alright, we are going to head to the back and see what they got. And we do not have the new ones over here either, so... I'm going to have to figure out a very creative thumbnail for this one, so let's see what I end up coming up with for the thumbnail, because none of the new releases are on the shelf. Alright, so I have just left Best Buy, and I got a bag. And no, this, yes, this is a Target bag, but no. 
I don't have anything from Target. It was just, I left my reusable bag at home. So I went for the first random bag that was in my car, which happened to be a Target bag. So I did manage to get a couple new releases. And once I get to my car, I will show everyone what I picked up. But first, I've got to say, <sighs> sometimes I go in there and things are good, and sometimes I go in there and things are bad. And today, I, I just don't know. I don't know. That's all I can really say. But enough talking about me feeling disappointed with Best Buy. How about I go on ahead, get in my car, and show you what I picked up on new release Tuesday. All right, so I am back in my car. Time to show everyone what I picked up on new release Tuesday. All right, the first one is not a new release, but it was the last copy left. So I had to go on ahead and pick it up, and that is the original Grinch on Blu-ray. For the record, I will be showing off a Christmas collection video later this week. I am not much of a Christmas person, but... My mom is, and my mom said that we've got to watch something Christmassy on Christmas, and Die Hard doesn't count. For starters, please comment down below, Die Hard is a Christmas movie, so I can show my mom this when I go over to her house on Christmas. It would be greatly appreciated, so please, comment down below, Die Hard is a Christmas movie. But I went on ahead and picked this up so I don't have to hear as much complaining about me just bringing Die Hard over. This next one is not a new release for this week, but it is something I've been wanting to get. And for what it, various reasons, I have not picked it up the last few weeks because I've been trying to get other stuff. This week, I had to pick it up. It was on sale. Doom Patrol Season 3. If you've seen some of my other videos, this is probably my favorite comic book show currently airing new episodes. Season 4 either just debuted or is about to debut. I really hope they keep it on beyond Season 4. However, all this regime change crap that Warner Brothers is doing, I'm prepared that my favorite comic book show currently on is coming to an end. One of the big ones I told everyone I was here to pick up. The Silent Night Deadly Night Collection. This has three, four, and five in one nice little set. And it's got the digital copy. I'm going to be honest with everyone. I have never watched any of these. So I don't know what to expect. Yes, I'm aware they probably suck. But is what it is. And last, but not least, I picked up Smile. For anyone that is wondering, I went with the Blu-ray over the 4K just to save a little bit of money. So, I went with the Blu-ray. I will have a pinned comment down below I saw this in theaters opening weekend. I loved it. It was great. There were some scenes that scared the shit out of me. So if you haven't checked that out, pinned comment down below will feature my review for Smile. And this is everything I picked up on New Release Tuesday. And as always, if you are new to this channel, Hit that subscribe button. You like what you see? Leave a thumbs up. Comment down below for one of two things. One, Die Hard is a Christmas movie. I really need to show that to my mom because she doesn't believe me. And two, let me know what you picked up on new release Tuesday. But that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all for watching and tune in next time.